hello and welcome to my youtube channel OS VFX in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create animated timeline slide in PowerPoint this is how the slide works you can see here there's a road or a path or a journey and you can define for each year what are the the titles and the image here so I've just used from 2018 till 2014 so let's see how to create this slide in PowerPoint add a new slide go to insert shapes select triangle which is under basic shapes maybe this much size bring to the extreme right of the slide right mouse click say edit point and just drag the point towards left maybe something like this and change the color to somewhat some gray color and no outline or you can if you want you can add the smaller outline but no need let me just give some darker color here all right go to insert and select shape select the uh, oval shape draw the oval shape by holding the shift key make it no outline and shape fill I'm just going to use some green color I'm going to add one more oval shape which is maybe the bigger of the size shape outline make the same green color and shape fill make it no fill and the outline weight I'm just going to increase this alright either you can just group it and right mouse click go to format shape effects under 3d rotation select the off axis one top something like this and just bring it here alright and then I'm just going to add one more rectangle smaller line make it green color if you want or you can use some different color and I'm just going to give a kind of a shadow effect here for that I'm going to use something the oval shape draw the oval shape something like this make it no outline under fill select gradient fill select this option linear down I'm going to make it somewhat darker color here and here somewhat lighter color and transparency level I'm just going to reduce the transparency level here just reduce the size if you want and just bring it here maybe further alright so something similarly I'm just going to do maybe we can have somewhat more alright then like this I'm just going to add the text here text box I'll say 2018 make the font Oswald if you don't have you have to download it make it green color and if you want if, if you have a picture or image which is something like this I'm just going to copy the image here and then you can type the text again I'm just going to copy the text here so that will save time in making this video group it sorry right mouse click group it so we have done with 2018 so similarly I'm just going to select this printer, uh, this oval shape press ctrl D and you can 
bring it here and then you can just reduce the size a little bit press ctrl D bring it here further reduce the size again press ctrl D you can further reduce the size same thing I'm going to use and reduce the size and if you want you can have some different colors now this will be also sorry I have to select individually blue and this line color will be blue as well okay so again press ctrl D and then this is will be your 2017 and you can change the image if you want so likewise you can just do for the others also and you can just copy the shadow as well here and the shadow has to be keeps on reducing the size so once you have done this one your output will something looks like this alright so if you want to do some animation first of all I'm going to select all this object not this object right mouse click and you can group it once group you can go to animation enable the animation pane here and you can use the wipe effect which is coming from the bottom alright again similarly I'm just going to select for this as well right mouse click group it change this color to blue and this also I'm going to animation select wipe wipe that is after pre next on click so one to. Similarly, you can do for the rest of the slides as well or the shapes as well. So that's it from me friends. Hope you like this uh, video and if you uh, like this, please don't forget to subscribe my channel OSVFX. See you soon with more interesting stuff. Till then, goodbye.